Hello again everybody, welcome back and today we have a CCL mortise cylinder pinned up by Dembras, sent to me by the Bronx lock picker and we have quite a nice bitting on it it's a very high cuts right at the very back but all works just as it should all locked up so let's see if we can get into here and have a look and see what Den has put inside for us. So we'll begin at the front. Number one is binding. And we've got a click. It's gone loose. And we've got a second click. And now it's gone solid. Two three nothing four very crunchy a couple of clicks out of four and five on five again. Four feels like it's dropped. Another one on four. And a bit more out of five. Four. They feel very crunchy four and five. Nothing on anything else yet. We know four and five have got to be quite high. Five have dropped. From the key, and it feels like they are serrated with threading. It's very crunchy, the two back ones. If we can get this open and have a look inside, no doubt I'll be proved wrong. Nothing on one, nothing on two, nothing on three, four, five. So click on four. Nothing else talking to me at all. we haven't overset something like four dropped three that was three gave us a little bit of a full set there was another click on four five four touched one and we've got a bit deeper full set and two moved a fraction more right I'm getting 
getting counter rotation on two. Come on two. Why will it not go? Come on. Right, I think I've got two. And one. And we are in. So, quite a tricky little pick, that one. Let's get this vice out of the way. Stick that down there. Keep pins on that way, and there we go. And hopefully, we can see here. Looks like we've got threading in all five, and actually, looks like we've got some funniness going on with the pins. Well, we've got a T pin at the back in five. And it looks like we might have a pin in pin in three, if you can see. Let's dump these out. So we've got serrated in one. A serrated in two. That's number three. And it is a pin in pin. Number four, one deep serration and number five is the T-pin. So let's get the shim out. And tweezers. One, we've got some weirdness going on. Is that pin in pin? Or just there's a bit of a T pin and a spring again and in three we have a spool looks like the springs are all the same excuse the dogs just heard somebody outside then we've got a number five Serrations, lots of them. And in four, more serrations. And all the springs are the same. Let's just have a Feel in there. Nothing. 
nothing going on there. That's all standard inside. So, quick look at all these pins. Very nicely done. So, with the bitting on there, quite a tricky little lock to pick. So, thanks for sending that, Bronx Lock Picker, and thanks for making it, Denbrass. Nice fun pick. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon. Bye.